One, two. Check, check. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello. One, two, three, four. Mic test. Hello. Mic test. One, two. Mic test. One, two. One, two. Mic test. Hello. One, two. Mic test. Check. Check. My video camera. Can you hear me over there? You can hear me clearly? One, two, one, two, check, check. Kusar bhai sahab, you can hear me? Salman, you can hear me from here? One, two. Hello, one, two. We're in the middle of the Sharjah State where the heavy rollers are going on for tonight's finale of the Goodwill Cup 2022. The pitch, well, it's been played a lot, and that is why the heavy rollers are being preferred by the team. The first game is going to be the semi final of the championship between the Mumbai Stars, the Un Stars, versus. The Gujarat Titans. They have their own superstar, Mustafa Messi. He will be up against Murtaza Trankwala. This pitch is shining at the moment. All the heavy roller has pinned the grass inside. It looks a tough wicket, but as the day goes on, it Check, check. I think it's Yahan se relay boats do it. Check. Jaldi karai ho na tan ho jayenge hamlo. Right? Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Sharjah Cricket Stadium with the grand finale of the Goodwill Cup 2022. Top time here at the Sharjah Cricket Stadium. And I have with me in the first semi-final between the unbeaten Mumbai Stars led by Hussein Arsiwala versus the Gujarat Titans led by Mustafa Messi, who's the second highest scorer after Murtaza Tra. I have with me in the guests Murtaza Bhai Saab and Ali Asgar, and the match ref Saeed Razak Ali. Murtaza Bhai Saab has the coin with him, and the two captains here, Hussein Arsi from Mumbai Stars 
and Mustafa Messi will call. T10 is the call and T10 it is as per the match referee. Mustafa Messi, you have won the toss. What do you want to do? We will bowl first. Any reason behind you choosing to bowl first, Mustafa? Nothing. We want to... Uh, we want any target around 75 to 80 runs because they have a big player, Murtuza Trankwala. If he gets the target, he is not giving a chance to anyone. So we would like to choose ball first. We want to set the target around 80. And I think our batting line is around 80 to 90. He is 120 runs ahead of you. Is that playing in your mind or you just want to beat him? That's it. I am not playing any tournament for my batting score. I am not watching anything. I want to just win a match. That's it. All the best, Murtuza. Hussein Arsiwala, you've lost the toss. Usually, you have been chasing and Trankwala has batted the opposition out of the game. Now, this is the first time in a knockout, you are going to be batting first. What's the target you're looking at? Probably around 100. And uh, Murtuza is definitely there. And other boys, you know, other batters are playing around him. So, we are not worry worried about anything. We definitely up for any kind of challenges. So we are on for the game. You've been comprehensively in the but knockouts are a different story. What you think as Mumbai as unbeaten in the tournament, I'm sure there's no pressure on you. Uh, the environment in the dressing room with the boys is very, very calm and cool and collective. As, as soon as we finish our first match, or whatever matches up till now, nine matches, we forget about those matches and we go ahead. So it's ball for ball game. That's it from the center. Gujarat Titans have won the toss and they have elected to bowl first. We'll be back with the live action shortly. Thirty minutes, minutes ago, it was, was Gujarat, Gujarat Titans, Titans that called T10, T10 and, and it came T10, T10 in favor of the Gujarat Titans. Titans and Mustafa Messi, the captain, had no hesitation in putting Mumbai stars into bat. Murtuza Trankwala, all eyes are going to be on him. He's the highest run scorer in this tournament. And the umpires are on the field. Asif Iqbal and Sayyad Zargam are two umpires for the first semi-final between the Mumbai stars. The batsmen are ready. Shabir and Murtuza Trankwala have also entered the field. And now it will be time for Mustafa Messi to lead his Titans on to the ground. They are in a huddle at the moment. Lot of nerves as we can feel. They have lost to Mumbai stars in the Super 6. And the last of the huddles, the batsmen are out on the center. The umpires are taking their position. And I'm going to be taking, uh, giving it over to my colleague, my co-commentator, APD for the first time today. And Gujarat Titans in the huddle. And Mustafa Messi has made his way in the center with Gujarat. A thrilling match. Gujarat Titans winning the toss, electing to field first. We are just moments away for the first semi-final here. Let's hear it from our third commentator as well, Mr. Josefa. बहुत बहुत शुक्रिया अमान भाई और अब्दुल कादिर भाई हमारे साथी कमेंटेटर्स ये पहला सेमीफाइनल होगा मुंबई टाइटंस वर्सेस गुजरात गुजरात टाइटंस Then 
मैच शुरू हुआ जाता है पहला सेमीफाइनल मुंबई बैटिंग के लिए तैयार है गुजरात बॉलिंग के लिए अपनी फील्ड की सेटिंग में मसरूफ कप्तान मुस्तफा मैसी स्टार बैट्समैन बहुत बड़ी टीम मुंबई अब तक बहुत ही कामयाब पहले नंबर पर है इस टूर्नामेंट के अंदर मुंबई स्टार्स की टीम और चौथे नंबर पर है गुजरात टाइटंस की टीम इन दोनों टीमों के दरमियान ये पहला सेमीफाइनल एस बी टी टेन And the umpires are now going to call time. The batsmen are on strike. Shabir is going to take strike. Let's kick off the SB10 semi-final one. The first ball coming up. A lovely check shot there, and Mumbai is off the mark. So is Shabir. First ball, and Shabir is off. The mark, so is Mumbai Stars. Let's see. The pressure is on Mumbai Stars because Titans won the toss and put them into bat. Usually, usually Mumbai have chased totals with disdain. They have knocked the opposition out within six, seven overs. And it's for the first time they will have to be putting up a total. And it's that man, the man of the tournament so far. Murtaza Trankwala on strike. Straight to the fielder. But a confident looking stroke there, ABD. Good signs for Mumbai already and Trunkwala there. He's been in tremendous form. He's starting off from where he left yesterday in the evening. What a delivery that is. Right in the block hole. Mohammed is right on the money. And that's in the air, and the fielder coming in, and he's dropped it. Could this be an important drop in the context of the game? Electric wala there, missed time shot, and Gujarat Tartan's captain will not be happy with that effort. That should have been taken ABD. Absolutely. In the semi-final, in the crunch game, it is catches which win matches. Can go with the board, 
Last ball, Muhammad Khan, he will be gifted with that drop. Now it's trunk on strike. And a missed time shot there for a single. With that, the first over comes to an end. An eventful first over from Muhammad Khan. Four without loss, Mumbai Stars. ABD, what do you think? I'm sure Mustafa, Mustafa Messi will be happy with the call, winning the toss, fielding first, putting pressure right on. But it was the fielder who didn't support his bowler. Could have been one down easily there. ABD, they say catches win matches. And when especially it's a knockout, you have to take whatever comes in your favor. If Electric Wala, Electric Youths, Gujarat Titans today, It'll be curtains for them in the tournament. Absolutely, Aman. Absolutely. We have to wait and watch. Will Shabir Wala make them pay? And that's, that's a beautiful, beautiful looking shot, shot by Shabir Electric Wala. And that's and one bounce into the boundary. And, and see, as we just spoke, Shabir Electric Wala has, has just punished Gujarat Titans. Titans. Yes, and the bowler will be livid with it. He had him already. And, and then, then getting hit, hit for, for a four. four. So one over, eight runs for Mumbai. Yes, the Gujarat Titans have a strong batting lineup with Messi, the second highest run scorer. So the Mumbai Stars would be looking to score at least 100, 110 to put pressure in this knockout match. That's a good start from Josefa Patel, number seven, the new bowler in the attack. And Trunkwala, well, he will have to change his strategy. Usually he knows what he's chasing, but now he needs to put up a total. A good looking shot there. A good looking drive straight to long off fielder for a single. And Shabbir Electric Wala, the man who's already been given a life by the Titans, is now on strike. And that's a full toss from Patel and well played again by Shabir Electric Wala. He's off to an electric start but well fielded on the boundary. Two runs taken nonetheless. The score moves on to 11.
What a delivery there by Mohammad Khan there. A good reply after being hit for a four. Shabbir Electric Wala is thanking his stars today. He's been dropped once. The fielder didn't reach the second time. And the third time the ball has refused to take the edge. Everything going in favor of Shabbir Electric Wala. ABD, what do you have to say for the luck that he's brought in for the semi-final? He'll be lucky if he makes them pay, Haman. He's, He's now, now living, living cat, cat life. life. He, he has, has nine, nine lives. lives. Lovely ball there from Muhammad. Right in the block hole. Gujarat Titans have started well. And he's also known as Rabada. Is Muhammad come and 
he is bowling like a rabada himself that was a good reply a block hole delivery but well played by shabir electric wala let's see what he can do now What a beautiful looking shot by Shabir Electricwala. It was right in the zone. It was full. It was a half volley, a half tracker. And Shabir Electricwala, with the kind of form that he's shown so far, he was not going to miss out on that. What a beautiful shot over the covers for four. I'm in the kind of form and the kind of luck Shabir Electricwala is having. I'm sure he's going to make Gujarat pay heavy. He's already on 15 of 10. 19 of 11 after that boundary. And that's in the air! And that's taken! So Shabir Electric Wala doesn't trouble Gujarat Titans as much as we expected. But he was looking dangerous ABD. And feel for thought for that fielder who dropped that catch. He would be breathing a sigh of relief. Absolutely, Absolutely, and it is that, that man, man Rabada Aman, who, takes, who takes the wicket. The wicket. Rabada, Rabada is right on the money, is Muhammad Khan. With his With last, last delivery, he takes a wicket. wicket. Nonetheless, Nonetheless, it's a, it's good, a good innings good from Shabir Electric Wala. He's, he's given, given the start the, the Mumbai Stars, Stars wanted. wanted. He's, he's given time to trunk to see the pitch and play out. He is attacked. He's given his best man the time to to set in. And now, he will be expecting his partner to explode. So, uh, Mohammed Khan getting his man, finally. He was dropped in that first over, but getting the wicket in his second, in his final over of a spell. So Gujarat Titans, the strategy seems to be working so far of putting Mumbai Stars into bat. Mumbai Stars usually don't attack so much in the start, but now they have to, because they have to set a total that is worthy of winning this semi-final. And if they, it, it, it is going to be worthy, it's going to be more than 90 for sure. So three overs for 22 for one. Mumbai stars. Murtaza Trunkwala is on three runs of six deliveries, Aman. That's pressure. I think so. That's a good start there from Josefa Patel. He conceded just four runs ABD in that first over. And he started where he, he just started where he left off in that first over. This is good stuff from Gujarat Titans and their bench. That's a lovely ball again there. They want to come back for two and get, will get it easily. And the Gujarat and Titans bench is feeling it here. They are the most vocal Mumbai stars who have been unbeaten in this tournament at the moment are nervously watching on. I mean, something's gonna give in this delivery, I feel. Oh, beautifully played Murtaza Trunkwala. What a good looking shot that is. A bowler just drifted just a bit wide of outside off stump. And what a beautiful looking cut stroke there from Murtaza Trunkwala. Well, class speaks for itself. That's a delicate touch, Aman. What a shot that is. Pleasing to the eyes, that one. These are the kind of situation that players like Murtaza Trunk, Mustafa, Messi thrive on. And right, and right now, now we are seeing, seeing the class of Murtaza Trunkwala. 3.328 for one. Wow. 
what a beautiful looking shot that is just guided from his wrist into the gap but just a single there good feeling from the titans feel that they're on the boundary coming in quickly number 531 the 51 the score has moved on to 29 fourth over in play Josefa Patel will now be bowling to Hussein 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 Narsingwala 1-1-2 will be facing and that's well played again but there's a sweeper fielder there they will take the two for the throw because the boundary is wide and two has been completed Hussein Narsingwala gets off on strike here and gets off the mark for his first delivery Score moves on to 31. Last ball, I guess, of Josefa Patel's spell. 31 in four overs will be a good, good start here from the Mumbai Stars. Oh, that hurried on to the batsman there. That was good thinking. But will they run too? Murtaza Trunkwala thinks so, but not his partner. And that's the end of the fourth over. Mumbai Stars are on 32 with a loss of one wicket. Their net run rate is 8 per over. And if they continue at this rate, they would reach the average total in a T10. That is around 80, 85 runs. ABD, they need to put the foot on the pedal now with 6 overs to go and 9 wickets remaining. They want so it's like 10 balls for Murtuza Trangwala and scored 10 runs after four. Now he has to put the accelerator as well. And I think the captain is bringing himself on here by the looks of it. One Messi is in the World Cup final. Will this Messi reach the Goodwill Cup final? Only time will tell. The captain, the captain Mustafa, Mustafa Messi, Messi, he, he wants, wants to restrict Trunkwala to as low as possible because he's just 120 runs behind him in this tournament. They both are the leading run scorers by far in this tournament. And it's going to be Shab uh, Hussein Narsingwala on strike. And it's going to be that number 10, Mustafa Messi, the captain of the Titans. Shot and that's the in the air. The coming underneath that. Will he take it? And he that's takes taken. it. One, One more wicket down. And this time, it's Hussein Narsingar. It was a short ball. Could have hit it anywhere in the ground. Did not time it too well. And the fielder did well to judge it on the boundary. And one more wicket down for the Mumbai Stars. In the form of Hussein Narsingar. And Hussein Disawala walks back. Walks to the crease now. With the team needing some batsmen to score runs along with Mursa Trankwala. Wow, the man with the golden arm, Mustafa Messi. The word Messi can't do anything wrong in the month of December, it seems. One has taken Argentina to the final and one is taking the flag of Gujarat Titans high and has taken a wicket, much needed wicket of Hussein Narsingwala who can be dangerous as we saw in yesterday's game against the South Stallions. And now it's going to be Shabir Disawala or Deswala. He's going to be on strike accompanying Trunkwala here. But Messi has struck most importantly. Now, can he strike again? And the, and the Gujarat, Gujarat Titans, Titans bench, bench is pumped, pumped up, up while, while the Mumbai, Mumbai stars are feeling the nerves of this semi-final. They, they have never, never been tested, tested so far batting, batting first. first. And wide and signal there by the umpire. The umpire. Messi, Messi getting carried away there a little. But, but let's see, he's the, the captain. captain. There is a reason he's brought himself on. He feels Mumbai are under pressure. And when they say, strike when the iron is hot. 
And is that a good effort there by the keeper? Good, smart thinking. And as I was saying, strike when the iron is hot and make it hot by striking it. Messi is taking full advantage of the situation. Yes, absolutely. You can see the battle of nerves going out there. Smartly played on the offside for a single. Just easing the pressure, getting the well set batsman. Murtaza Tranquala on strike. Two star players, Mustafa Messi bowling to Murtaza Tranquala now. Well, this is the battle. And respected by Tranquala there. He respects. The stature, the stature of the bowler he's faced. He just, just played there on the leg side. side. This, this is, is going to be a game, game of chess. chess. Who, Who makes, makes the right move? move? Don't go, go anywhere, ladies and gentlemen. gentlemen. This, this is a match. match. This, this is the battle, battle that has, has to be watched. watched. It'll be on the offside, but there's a fielder down at the longer boundary. Call for second, but no sent back, and rightly so. This is what happened to Disawala two games ago, two days ago. He ran, he tried to go for the second, but from the boundary, Gujarat Gladiators fielder hit the stumps directly, but this time, fortunate for him, there was no direct hit. Yes, you need to learn from your mistakes and learn them quickly. This is good thinking by Messi. He's taken the pace of the ball, he wants Trunkwala to do all the hard work. What a great first over coming to an end. Mustafa Messi, the captain, making it even messier for the Mumbai Stars. Five overs, 36 for two. Five over 36 new bowler coming in. And with that, we have a change in commentary. We have Mr. Mufaddal and Huzefa from Karachi. Thank you, Aman Bhai. And one more wicket down. Hussein Tisawala. He stumped out the wicket keeper. And lightning flash speed. Hatim Muhammad was swift there. And that's the end of Husendi Sawala. And Mumbai lose their third wicket and are under tremendous pressure now in the semi finals, unbeaten in the league matches. And they are really being tested here by the Gujarat Titans and Messi. Tisra wicket Girayapar, Mumbai. Burhanuddin Godrawala out hooker pavilion me wapis. Burhanuddin Godrawala the baller. Thirty six for three. Chhatti run per team. Victor ke nuksan per Mumbai. Chhatte over ka khel. होगा यहाँ पर
36 रन मुंबई तीसरे विकेट के नुकसान पर नए आने वाले बैट्समैन हैं हुसैन हुसैन आए हैं बैटिंग करने के लिए मुंबई के लिए बुरहानुद्दीन गोदरा है बॉलर गेम करेंगे बुरहानुद्दीन अच्छा शॉट इट इज स्ट्रेट टू द फील्ड नाउ विल ही टेक इट एंड ही टेक्स इट दैट्स द फोर्थ विकेट डाउन फॉर द मुंबई स्टार्स एंड द मुंबई स्टार्स आर इन डिसबिलीफ एट द मोमेंट The batting lineup is being tested. Burhanuddin Godrawala getting a wicket of a second delivery. Fourth wicket gira yahan par Mumbai Stars ki chauthi wicket 36 runs par bahut hi achhi grip ki yahan par Gujarat Titans ki team ne chautha nuksan Mumbai ko uthana pada. शानदार परफॉर्मेंस बॉलिंग से गुजरात टाइटन शानदार बॉलिंग चौथा नुकसान मुंबई स्टार्स की टीम की तरफ हुसैन रानी वाला द बैट्समैन देर ट्राइंग टू हिट सिक्स ऑफ द फर्स्ट डिलीवरी एंड स्वेट टू द फील्डर एंड वेरी वेल जज कैच एट द बाउंड्री बाय मुर्तजा कॉन्ट्रैक्टर ही डिड रियली वेल जैसे टू परफेक्शन तमाम तर जिम्मेदारियां आप मुर्तजा ट्रंक वाला के मजबूत कांधों पर मुंबई स्टार्स के स्टार बैट्समैन मुर्तजा ट्रंक वाला इस पर क्रीज पर मौजूद है उनका विकेट पर मौजूद रहना मुंबई के लिए बहुत ही अच्छा होगा यहां पर मुफदल भाई क्या कहेंगे इस बारे में मुफदल ट्रंक वाला क्रीज पर मौजूद है Yes, he needs to be there till the end, and he needs to be watchful as well. Three Husseins have gone gone down in quick succession. Hussein Narsinghar, Hussein Nisa, and Hussein Raniwala, and now we have Hussein Bhutwala. All Husseins, and the next next band to go in is Hussein Arsiwala. Five Husseins in the line, and we hope at least one Hussein clicks here. Appeal LBW. What's an appeal for LBW? Was a hat trick ball. The Empire not interested. And Hussein survives. The bowl are not happy. All the fielders on the pitch were convinced. And Hussein Bhutwala survives. As Murtaza Trankwala watches the wickets fall from the other end. Just, just releasing the pressure, pressure with that single, single. Hussein Bhutwala gets, gets off the mark, and that, that brings Mutsa Chankwala on strike. strike. It will be interesting to watch whether he plays the wait and watch game or does he accelerate the scoring with so many batsmen back in the pavilion. Of samna karenge Mutsa Chank. रोक कर संभाल कर खेले बॉलर जी की तरफ एक रन बनाने का मौका मिला दोनों बैट्समैनों को चहलकदमी करते हुए एक रन मुकम्मल किया द फॉल ऑफ विकेट हैज फर्स्ट मुर्सा ट्रंक फाला टू प्ले वॉच फुली शॉट हवा में है गेंद फील्डर गेंद के नीचे एक रन बनाने का मौका मिला फंबल किया दूसरा रन तेरी तेजी के साथ मुकम्मल किया बहुत अच्छी तेज रनिंग बिटवीन द विकेट दोनों बैट्समैनों के दरमियान
came into bat, but things not going as per their plan. But you never know. There are four overs. And Mutsa Tankwala, the highest run scorer. This is the testing phase for him. And we often see champions thrive on these conditions. Will this just be the day? छे ओवर में चालीस रन छ ओवर चालीस रन चार विकेटों के नुकसान पर मुंबई स्टार्स तमाशाइयों की बड़ी तादाद इस बड़े मुकाबले में कप्तान आए हैं मुस्तफा मैसी एक रन बनाने का मौका मिला दूसरा रन खतरनाक साबित हो सकता है यहां पर पवेलियन एंड से कप्तान मुस्तफा मैसी मुस्तफा मैसी गेंद करेंगे और ये नए बैट्समैन हुसैन स्ट्राइक पर हैं और ये बहुत अच्छी गेंद मैसी द्वारा मैसी कुछ गलत कर ही नहीं सकते हैं और ट्रंक वाला मना करते हुए दो रन के लिए ट्रंक वाला अब ऐसी दुविधा में है कि वो मार के खेले या वो रोक कर खेले या वो अगर वो दस ओवर तक टिकते हैं तो ये मैं आपको दावे के साथ कह सकता हूं जेफा भाई कि पिछहत्तर अस्सी तो बन ही जाएगा सिर्फ उनके वहां खड़े रहने से बिल्कुल अमान भाई इनका खड़ा रहना जरूरी अच्छा शॉट इस मरतबा गेंद लॉन्ग ऑन पोजीशन पर आई एक रन तेजी के साथ मुकम्मल किया दूसरा रन खतरनाक साबित हो सकता है और आउट रन आउट हुजेफा भाई इसे कहते हैं प्रेशर कुकर जिस पे मुंबई स्टार्स अब फटना शुरू हो चुकी है बिकॉज 42 टू फाइव विकेट और ये प्रेशर रन था कोई जरूरत नहीं थी दूसरा भागने की ट्रंक वाला अभी भी मौजूद है पिच पर लेकिन ये कहता हूं एक लैप्स ऑफ जजमेंट है बैट्समैन द्वारा बिकॉज ये पहली बार है टूर्नामेंट में जब मुंबई स्टार्स को इतने प्रेशर में डाला गया एब्सोल्युटली एंड द प्रेशर शोइंग ऑन द मुंबई स्टार्स बैट्समैन देर वाज अ नॉन एग्जिस्टिंग सेकंड रन एंड आई डोंट नो व्हाई दिस ऑट ऑफ फॉर दैट एंड वन मोर हुसैन वॉक्स बैक टू द डग आउट आफ्टर फेलिंग टू स्कोर much mufaddal and it's and that, that man again, again the, the captain, captain of the gujarat titans, titans mustafa messi who has come again and taken a wicket from nowhere yes the pressure was caused by the dot balls he was bowling he's just given seven runs so far and now we have press wala on strike and he needs to really press it here in the in the middle of the charja cricket stadium he needs to stay there and see it out with trunk wala and that's well bowled again slow a delivery there and a miss feel not required will they go for two yes they will and trunk wala gets, gets a, he steals a run there and messi is not happy there he is livid at the moment and still giving the looks to his fielder and trunkwala moves on to 16 with just one boundary a fairly sedate start from him compared to his previous performances and this time he played it straight struck well but straight to the fielder one more single and mufaddal um, we we never, never praise the fielder the here at the boundary for that run out that was a good throw in the hand of mustafa messi right on top of the bails so good effort there from number 52 who's at the long on position wahid basha yes there were two good fielding performances one this run out and the previous catch on the long off boundary was a very well judged one can be tricky when the ball is high in the air but he did it to perfection the last the ball, ball of this over now, now can pre press wala take, take this, this pressure, pressure. And, and 
And that's just well played. Well negotiated by Presswala. Takes a single. Rotates the strike. With that, the end of the seventh over. And Mumbai stars are struggling at 47 for five. Will, yes. will they be Mufaddal? Will they be playing the finals at 8.45 p.m.? Or will the Emirates leaving 7.30 to Mumbai will be filled? Time will tell. My heart says yes, but my mind says something else. With three overs to go, Presswala and Trunkwala need to put that need to press the accelerator and take the score past 75. Yes, I think they need to press the accelerator now. The scorecard, 6.7 runs per over. And they really need to, need to do something and something very quickly. Unfortunately, they don't have many wickets in hand and the pressure is on them. We'll wait to see what the batsmen decide to play or wait and watch games still or Take the aerial route now. As you can hear, the Gujarat Titans bench. And wrapped on the patch, and Abba has given it out. He has given it out, so Presswala cannot press any further. He needs to walk back to the pavilion. And what a timely wicket again, 47 for 6. And, and Mumbai, Mumbai stars, stars, well, that, that star is not, is not twinkling, twinkling today. It's the, the Titans, Titans that are roaring at the Sharjah the Cricket Stadium, Stadium in this first semi-final of the Goodwill Cup, Cup UAE 2022. 2022. Yes, yes, the Mumbai, Mumbai stars, stars batsmen batsman, falling like a deck of cards here in the semi-finals. Semi -finals. The, batting the batting first for the first time in this tournament. tournament. Never, Never been, been tested. tested. And this, this time... time Things, Things not going, going right, right for them. For them. And, and tremendous, tremendous pressure, pressure on Trunkwala now. He's the lone man standing as he's seeing the wickets falling at the other end. And with that wicket, Burhan Godrawala becomes the highest wicket taker of this tournament with 14 wickets. What a time to put your hands up and stand up for your team. Burhan Godrawala, take a bow. Well well, 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 looking at this, this performance, performance, Mumbai stars came into this knockout, this semi final. Favorites for this tournament by a mile, they were favorites. But today, the toss gods were not in their favor. They lost the toss. And guess what Messi did? He put them to bat. And Messi has decided. Oh, sorry, oh, sorry. Trunk, Trunk has decided, has decided he, he will play out these 10 overs and at least put up a respectable total that, that Mumbai Stars bowlers can defend. And we have Hussein Arsiwala, the Mumbai Stars captain on strike. Plays it away defensively, giving the strike to Hussein Murza Trunkwala. They don't have many options right now. Mufadal, the, the script is very simple if you're Mumbai Stars. Batsman coming in. Just get off strike. Give your main man, Trunkwala, the limelight. Let him take you home from here. Oh, that is a poor, poor piece of fielding by number seven there. I think it's Josefa Patel. And two runs taken. The Mumbai star. Batsmen need a few boundaries now <coughs> as we have only 14 deliveries left in this innings. And you have the players from Mumbai Stars there and the fans there. They won the repeat of last evening there, but it's all about Gujarat Titans at the moment. Let us see if the supporters can do some motivation for the team. Jitega, Jitega. Jitega by Jitega.
What a lovely spell that is from Burhanuddin Godra. He becomes the leading wicket taker in this tournament and he has the spell of two overs, nine runs, three wickets. What an effort in the semi-finals from Burhanuddin Godra. Left in the innings, Mursa Tankwala and the Mumbai Stars captain Hossein Arsiwala are playing out there in the middle and they need to take their team through under this pressure, pressure situation in this knockout match at the Sharjah Cricket Stadium. 52 for 6 after 8 overs, 2 overs to go. Well, there is a saying in Calypso Cricket, it's never over till the fat lady sings. Mumbai stars should not put their shoulders down. If they were struggling to score, maybe if they can get Messi out early, even Gujarat Titans can struggle too. So it's never over until it's over in this game of cricket. Yes, the Mumbai Stars have a good bowling lineup as well. They've restricted the batsmen to under 70, 80 runs in the previous encounters. Cut on the offside by the captain Hussein Arsiwala, but just for a single. Something's got to give you a trunk, Wala. It's 11 balls. He needs, there has been no six hits so far in this innings. That is something to take a note of. Yes, he's just scoring at the rate of a runner ball. Yesterday we saw the crowd asking for a six and Murtzara Trankwala obliging. Will he repeat it today? And as we ask for a boundary, and that's one bounce, and Murtaza Trankwala has now decided he will go for it, much to the anticipation of the Mumbai supporters here in the stands. Yes, they were asking for a six, and Trankwala gives a boundary. And I think it's time he's decided to turn on the pedal now, with only 10 delivers remaining. And he's well set. He will take full advantage of the next 10 balls. Short on the offside, into the gap, going towards the boundary. Four more runs for Tranquilla. Two consecutive boundaries, just what the doctor ordered for the Mumbai Stars. Now, Murtaza Tranquilla is showing why he is the rightfully the man of the tournament wickets have been tumbling across him he's been watching like a spectator but look at his resolve look at his concentration look at his focus he has taken this game by the scruff of its neck and he has decided he will take mumbai stars to a respectable total aman i think he was just waiting for the last two of us to put on the pedals was it till then Call for a second run and and chance and that's overthrows. Two more runs. I'm sure they'll take. They've run four there. They have run four runs there. Wow. What a guy, Murtuza Trankwala. He has just run four. And Mustafa Messi is not happy. The Gujarat Titans, suddenly the Gujarat bench is not happy. They've just conceded 12 runs of three deliveries. And the momentum is shifting to the Mumbai camp. Very rarely do you see Aman, the batsmen running four runs. They are made to do the hard work. It's very unusual in this coaching heat as well. At the moment, this is smart cricket by Trunkwala. He's just taking a breather there by just talking to his non-trucking partner. I love this strategy. He needs it, he, and he deserves this break. He's batted really well, 32 so far. Six out of 65, that's half of the runs of Mumbai have been scored by this man of the tournament, 
by this great batsman, Murtaza Trunk. And he's cut it, and another misfield there. But this time, only one run being taken. And last ball of the penultimate over of this first semi-final. Mumbai Stars are on 66 for 6. One ball to go in the ninth over. Hussain Arsiwala on strike. I'm sure he'll not be looking for a single in the last delivery. He'll be looking to hit a shot. A boundary or a six. That's what the team needs. And that's a needless extra given there. And it will be rebowled by the bowler. And that's well played. Will they go for two? Trunk has just left. Look at him going there. And this is good cricket there. Sacrificing his wicket. With six balls to go, this was needed. And Murtuza Trunkwala. Well, what do I say about him? 67. He has scored 33 of those runs. He has taken Mumbai to a good position. Now, if they can score 10 or more in this last over, I think it will be a fighting total in a semi-final. You've got the runs on the board. The onus is on Gujarat Titans to chase it down. I say even if they had scored 50-55, it's runs on the board. It's a knockout game. Anything can happen. But 10 or more from here. And I think Mumbai stars... Let's do a test of the Mumbai and the Gujarat fans. Jeetega by Jeetega. Jeetega by Jeetega. Well, the Mumbai fans are winning this battle, but can the Gujarat team win the match? Only time will tell. Aman, 16 runs coming of the last over by Kuresh Rangwala. Trunkwala would be looking for a similar performance in this over as well. Sefuddin Mandapwala being introduced into this match for the first time. And Trunkwala is on strike. The good thing in the last over was that Hussein gave the strike back to Trunkwala. He did and it he's hit. chance for a catch. And it's and taken. It in. And guess who's taking the catch? It's the captain of the Gujarat Titans. Mustafa Messi, who cannot do anything wrong today. Yes, he, he's got to be there everywhere. In batting, in bowling, in fielding. And what's more, he's got the trump card. Trunkwala, the trump man for the Mumbai Stars, walks back to the dugout after a well-scored 33. He's been dismissed only the second time in this tournament. Trunkwala, he remained unbeaten in the other innings. Now let's hear from the fans. Jitega by Jitega! Jitega by Jitega! And they have got their voice back, Aman. Suddenly, Gujarat has found its voice. Trunkwala departs the beautiful innings. 33 runs. He played well. He kept the innings alive for the Mumbai Stars. He's kept them alive in this match so far. But 68 for 8 is not what the tournament favourites had ordered at the start, before the start of the semi-final. Now this has turned into a great semi-final here. The Titans will have their tails up, but it's a knockout game, runs are on the board, the pressure will be on the Titans to chase it down. Aman, the last 
batsman the tail end as a cow into bat mohammad bori wala alisgarh chital wala can they take the onus on themselves this is smart cricket mufaddal that's what they need to do they need to take that score as close to 75 as possible with four balls to go score is 69 the six I think the bowling changes that Messi did in this whole innings were really smart getting the right bowlers at the right time and that was a crucial part in this innings Aman Oh good shot there by Ali Asghar and a boundary a much needed boundary for the Mumbai Stars takes the score to 73 This is what the mumbai stars need they need some luck going their way yes uh, mohammad bori wala the wicket keeper of the mumbai stars this time playing away on the leg side the ball straying down the bowler needs to control his line and length good welcome boundary there for the mumbai stars 73 for 8 three deliveries left Ali Asghar there going for a big heave there miss play and a miss there and the bowler asking the keeper to just take a notch down a dot ball is good 73 for the loss of 8 wickets unusual territory for mumbai stars but they are a top top champion team and i'm sure they will give it their best to defend this chance direct hit is what was needed a single taken two balls to go 74 for 8 what a semi final we have in store yes the total is not very promising but in a knockout match even small totals can put the pressure because it is a knockout match the team knows there's no other way out and sometimes that pressure can make things difficult and a needless run out here uh, it's a, it was a wide delivery why did the batsman have to run there nonetheless a score will a run will be added to the score but they are 75 for 9 now are the mumbai stars if this semi final is going this way in 45 minutes from now we have another semi final and that is between the nadi al burhani from pakistan versus oh sorry at 4 o'clock versus the dubai sultans the favorites from the local setup here in the uae led by hatim patwa that's another match and they played out a great great super six game last night in the wee, wee hours of midnight when nadi al burani made 95 or so and it was chased down easily by the dubai sultans that is a match to be looked out for And, and got behind and the what the, the batsman batsmen are walking out it, and the batsman has walked out the batsman has walked out here there Very was one ball still to go and it's over it's all over 10 over 75 is what the mumbai stars made it's not a great total but it is a total where they can challenge when we come back the gujarat titans will need 76 to book their date and be in the finals of the goodwill cup 2022 the mumbai stars would be thinking on the other hand how to shuffle their bowlers keep things in track and defend this total
with a 25-year legacy based on unwavering reliability and unflinching values, Goodwill developers have successfully created a community of 2,200 plus happy customers in Navi Mumbai who are cherishing the joy of abundance every day. Since 1997, we have expanded our footprint in residential and commercial spaces to over 2.5 million square feet. It has been a journey filled with many achievements, but our core value through those milestones has remained the same, that of living up to our name. We have always placed supreme emphasis on seamless process and aligned all our team members to execute every effort with efficiency. Over the years, we have also established a reputation for completing all projects on time for possessions as it is the most crucial ingredient required to retain trust in customers. Our business model also follows transparency in our dealings so as to ensure no roadblocks on our passage to success. Our grand vision is to create new age landmarks that exemplify excellent expertise in both the science and the art of construction. Our mission is to become a name synonymous with honesty and earn recognition across the length and breadth of the country. At Goodwill Developers, we believe that true business is more than just mere numbers. It's also about lives enriched and stories created. Our diverse portfolio of completed projects, our recently completed project, Goodwill Unity, a thriving landmark in Sanpada, serves as a symbol of quality delivery. Goodwill Abort Dungarli Lunavla Located amidst hilly Lunavla, Goodwill Abort is an address where tranquility attains a presence that is as eternal as time. These are recently completed lavish 3, 4 and 5 BHK villas. with a private plunge pool in each villa. You can luxuriate in the lavish environs of an one-acre recreational space with amenities like clubhouse, modern gymnasium, cafe, swimming pool and astroturf. Living at any of the luxurious villas isn't just a privilege, it's a mark of having it all. In the past, we have also executed several other dresses with similar panache and perfection. Our broad presence has expanded with four landmark and priceless projects added in our crown. Our current ongoing projects stand as testaments of our expertise in building eminent structures. Goodwill Biz Hub Strategically situated next to IKEA in Navi Mumbai's commercial epicenter, Goodwill Biz Hub offers commercial spaces for MSMEs to access the apex of a thriving market. Furthermore, Goodwill Biz Hub also provides commercial spaces on the ground floor and boutique offer spaces on the 8th and 9th floor. Spread across an enormous 4 acres, the landmark is a G plus 9 storey edifice with 16 feet floor to floor height. The shining highlight of this project is that the first to the seventh floor will be dedicated to industrial MSME units. To ease the experience of business processes, there is an exclusive ramp provided for tempo with 5 to 7 tons capacity on each floor. In total, the project will have 18 elevators to support various functions and a 12 meter internal driveway to smoothen the processes. This is a realm where ambition doesn't have to stay limited to touching the sky. The work is going on in full swing so as to ensure possession in just a year's time. We have now launched our commercial project, codename W High Street. Located off Palm Beach Road, this prestigious landmark will offer 32 dual level retail showrooms on G plus one level. These spaces will have 14 feet height on each floor. Curtsy, its prime location, which enjoys superb market loyalty, investing here is sure to yield high rental income. These outlets have maximum visibility thanks to 42 meter and 11 meter wide roads adjoining the project. It's time for you to book it, own it, and flaunt it. Code name Westview.
Find a new canvas for redefining your imagination in three and four premium bed residences. 3 BHK starting from 1130 square feet. 4 BHK starting from 1940 square feet with sprawling decks overlooking the hills, the city and the sea. Situated in an upper crust corner of Palm Beach Road in Sector 19, Farshi. These are homes that brew a serene blend between the best of lifestyle amenities, courtesy a clubhouse on the podium level. Unveiling soon. With a vision to continue in the same vein as the last 25 years, Goodwill developers are looking ahead towards a future filled with many more milestones, many more happy families and many more incredible addresses. Five, four, three, two, one. And the Titans are off the mark. Kuzefa by Penny Gain. Bohot a chitara kail deal. Square leg ki disha me. Ek run. Titans are off. Acha shuruat. Titans ka. Pella run. Titans ke khate me aya yapar. Hassan Ali है baller Hassan Ali Mumbai के left arm baller Hassan Ali pavilion end से गेंद करेंगे अच्छा शॉट सीधा मिड ऑन पोजीशन पर तेजी के साथ एक रन मुकम्मल किया अच्छी फील्डिंग वहां पर मिड ऑन पोजीशन पर फील्डर की तरफ से हुसैन हुसैन आए हैं बॉलिंग करने के लिए मुंबई के राइट आर्म ऑफ स्पिनर हुसैन गेंद करेंगे हुसैन नर्सिंग वाला बॉलर है और अब स्ट्राइक पर आ गए हैं सैफुद्दीन मंडप वाला सैफुद्दीन और मोहम्मद खंबलिया वाला ओपनिंग पैर है गुजरात टाइटंस के फुल डिलीवरी और खेल दिया लॉन्ग ऑन की दिशा में एक रन बहुत ही अच्छी शुरुआत है टाइटंस द्वारा तीन गेंदे तीन रन और अब स्ट्राइक पर आ गए हैं रबाडा क्या बल्ले क्या खिलाड़ी हैं पहला ओवर भी डालते हैं अपनी टीम का और ओपनिंग भी आते हैं ऐसे ऑलराउंडर्स होते हैं आपकी टीम में जो टी टेन और टी ट्वेंटी में जिनकी आपकी जरूरत होती है उसेफा भाई सही कहा आपने अमान भाई यहां पर स्विच किया है कप्तान ने अच्छा शॉट सीधा खेले हैं और गेंद बाउंड्री लाइन पार कर गई चार रन के लिए बहुत ही आला स्ट्रोक मोहम्मद खान द्वारा वो खंबे जैसे खड़े हैं क्या वो गुजरात टाइटंस को नदियां पार कराएंगे बिल्कुल 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 अमान भाई बहुत ही उम्दा टाइमिंग अच्छा शॉट सीधे बल्ले के साथ खेले गैप था वहां पर लॉन्ग ऑफ बाउंड्री की तरफ चार रन के लिए बहुत ही उम्दा शॉट नाम रबाडा मोहम्मद खम का 
लेकिन खेल साउथ अफ्रीका जैसी रही थी मुंबई स्टार्स पहली इनिंग्स में देखते हैं क्या वो कम कर पाएंगे रब्बाडा गुजरात के लेफ्ट हैंडेड पावर हिटर बैट्समैन अच्छा शॉट इस पर तबाह फील्डर मौजूद है यहां पर एक रन बनाने का मौका मिला दोनों बैट्समैनों को इसके साथ ही हुसैन का ओवर अख्ताम को पहुंचा इसी के साथ आठ रन एक ओवर के बाद छिहत्तर है टारगेट अब इन्हें चाहिए और अड़सठ रन नौ ओवरों में की अच्छी तादाद इस पहले सेमीफाइनल में एस बी टी टेन का पहला सेमीफाइनल फुल डिलीवरी और बहुत ही अच्छी तरह से कलाइयों का उपयोग करते हुए ऑन ड्राइव किया रबाडा ने पहली बॉल पे सिंगल लेके स्ट्राइक रोटेट किया अब सैफुद्दीन मंडप वाला स्ट्राइक पर है अपना गार्ड लेते हुए हासन अली ढोलका वाला क्या कर सकते हैं क्या वो मुंबई स्टार्स को इस गेम में वापस ला सकते हैं वो इस टीम के सबसे अच्छे बॉलर रहे हैं गेंदबाज 12 विकेटों के साथ अग, हासन अली रबाडा उनसे बात करते हुए मैं सुन रहा था मुस्तफा मैसी की स्पीच जस्ट बिफोर ये इनिंग स्टार्ट हुई उन्होंने अपने बल्लेबाजों से कहा एक दो एक दो करके खेलेंगे और आगे बढ़ेंगे देखते हैं क्या वो ये कर पाते हैं हसन अली हसन अली है बॉलर अच्छा शॉट बैकफुट पर गए सीधा फील्डर के हाथों में गई गेंद और मिस फील्ड करते हुए दे एक चांस हो सकता था रन आउट का लेकिन रबाडा काफी क्विक है और फील्ड चेंज करते हुए ये लेफ्ट हैंड राइट हैंड कॉम्बिनेशन हर कोई गेंदबाज लेफ्ट हैंड राइट हैंड कॉम्बिनेशन में बोलिंग नहीं कर सकता है उसके लिए आपको एक स्पेशल टैलेंट चाहिए लेकिन हसन अली क्या करते हैं शॉर्ट डिलीवरी और ये प्ले एन मिस रबाडा द्वारा और हसन अली डोलका वाला इस कॉम्पिटिशन में वापसी करते हुए अच्छी तरह शॉट डिलीवरी और ये खेल दिया रबाडा ने बहुत ही अच्छी तरह कवर्स के बीच चार रन बहुत ही उम्दा बैटिंग जिस हिसाब से गुजरात टाइटंस ने स्टार्ट किया है उनका मकसद सिर्फ एक है आज शाम आठ पैतालीस को उनकी टीम एसबीटी टेन सीजन फाइव गुडविल कप 2022 के फाइनल में होनी चाहिए इसी तरह से आज वो आए हैं और इसी तरह से वो आज खेल रहे हैं बहुत ही उम्दा शॉट एक और बाउंड्री मोहम्मद खम उर्फ रबाडा की अमान आपने आपने कुछ देर पहले कहा था कि मेसी ने अपनी टीम प्लेयर्स को बोला था एक दो एक दो करके लेंगे लेकिन शायद 
रबाडा ने ऐसा सुना कि एक दो एक दो बाउंड्री लेके जीतेंगे आप सही कह रहे हो रबाडा ने सुना वन टू का फोर और वो फोर मार रहे हैं सिर्फ मेसी उनसे कहना चाहते थे वन टू वन टू और रबाडा जी सुन गए वन टू का फोर बहुत ही आला बाउंड्रीज रबाडा के बल्ले से इसे कहते हैं अथॉरिटेटिव बैटिंग रबाडा ने मुंबई स्टार्स के सबसे ए सबसे अव्वल गेंदबाज को जो चौके मार के ये साबित कर दिया है कि वो अब किसी से नहीं डर रहे वो ये 76 के टोटल को जल्द से जल्द खत्म करना चाहेंगे क्योंकि जितना डीप ये गेम जाएगा उतना प्रेशर गुजरात टाइटन्स पे आएगा तो स्ट्रैटेजी यही होगी बहुत ही सिंपल है कि ये ये उनको आठ ओवर में चेस करना है इसी के साथ मैं थोड़ा सा ब्रेक लेता हूं और माइक देता हूं हुजैफा भाई को जो हमारे कॉन्टेस्ट विनर हैं कमेंट्री के स्पेशली कराची से आए हुए हैं बहुत बहुत शुक्रिया अमान भाई ये मैच इस वक्त गुजरात टाइटन की ग्रिप में और गुजरात टाइटन ने अब तक कोई विकेट नहीं खोया 19 रन बनाए हैं 19 रन बगैर किसी नुकसान के रबाडा रबाडा है बैट्समैन हुसैन है बॉलर रबाडा लेफ्ट हैंडेड मैसी ने तब्दीली लेकर आए मैसी और रबाडा को ओपनिंग करने के लिए भेजा और रबाडा ने आते ही अपना गेम दिखाया कदमों का इस्तेमाल किया बहुत ही शानदार विकटों के चारों तरफ दिलकश स्ट्रोक्स खेले अब तक दो ओवर में टाइटन ने बनाए 19 रन दो ओवर 19 रन बगैर किसी नुकसान के हुसैन आए हैं बॉलिंग करने के लिए गेंद करेंगे रबाडा को अच्छा शॉट गेंद आई लॉन्ग ऑन पोजीशन पर एक रन चहलकदमी करते हुए मुकम्मल किया दोनों बैट्समैनों ने हुसैन एक बार फिर पवेलियन एंड से मुंबई के ऑलराउंडर हुसैन गेंद करेंगे सैफुद्दीन सैफुद्दीन ने फील्ड का जायजा लिया और गेंद करेंगे हुसैन पवेलियन एंड से सैफुद्दीन है बैट्समैन टाइटन्स के गुजरात टाइटन्स ड्राइव किया एक रन तेजी से मुकम्मल किया लॉन्ग ऑफ के फील्डर आगे आए कवर्स पर गई थी गेंद कवर्स पर फील्डर मौजूद थे जिन्होंने डाइव लगाकर गेंद को रोका एक रन बनाने का मौका मिला जोशो खरोश बढ़ता हुआ गुजरात के कैंप में नॉट आउट 21 बगैर किसी नुकसान के अच्छा शॉट लॉन्ग ऑफ पर आई गेंद एक रन तेजी के साथ मुकम्मल किया दोनों बैट्समैनों ने हुसैन है बॉलर सैफुद्दीन है बैट्समैन सैफुद्दीन राइट हैंडेड बैट्समैन मुंबई को चाहिए विकेट्स और ढेर सारी विकेट्स बहुत अच्छी गेंद हुसैन की बीट हुए बैट्समैन सैफुद्दीन जोरदार हिट खेलना चाहते थे सैफुद्दीन बीट हुए अच्छी शुरुआत गुजरात टाइटन की तरफ से रिक्वायर्ड रन रेट बिलो एट रन पर ओवर इजीली अचीवेबल एंड द गुजरात Titan batsmen are getting runs at will at the moment. Safuddin hai batsman. Acha khele ek run tezi ke saath mukammal kiya dono batsmanon ne. Achhi tez running between the wicket. Kul score 22 run. 23 23. 
गुजराती में कई छे वांदो नहीं वांदो नहीं गुजराती गुजरात टाइटन निकल कर खेले गेंद हवा में है फील्डर गेंद के नीचे दो रन तीसरे रन के लिए भी निकल पड़े और इस मरतबा नॉट आउट का इशारा दिया एम्पायर ने अच्छी तेज रनिंग बिटवीन द विकेट गुजरात टाइटंस इसके साथ ही ओवर के अख्ताम पर कुल स्कोर तीन ओवर में 25 रन बगैर किसी नुकसान के गुजरात मुंबई को यह मैच जीतने के लिए विकेट लेना जरूरी है विकेट लेनी होगी यहां पर मुंबई को यह मैच जीतने के लिए 25 रन की शुरुआत दी है गुजरात के दोनों बैट्समैनों ने सैफुद्दीन है बैट्समैन इस मरतबा फाइन लेग बाउंड्री के ऊपर तेजी से एक रन मुकम्मल किया जल्दी करनी पड़ी दोनों बैट्समैनों को अच्छी रनिंग बिटवीन द विकेट दोनों बैट्समैनों की अच्छी अंडरस्टैंडिंग है दोनों के दरमियान अब सामना करेंगे रब्बाडा अली असगर है बॉलर बैट्समैन है रब्बाडा स्टार बैट्समैन रब्बाडा लेफ्ट हैंडेड गुजरात की शान रब्बाडा स्लाइड चेंज इन द फील्डिंग शॉर्ट गेंद थी इस मरतबा डीप मिड विकेट पर आई गेंद एक रन तेजी के साथ मुकम्मल किया दोनों बैट्समैनों ने अच्छी फील्डिंग हुई मिड विकेट के ऊपर डीप मिड विकेट पर फील्डर मौजूद थे अली असगर हैं बॉलर अब गेंद करेंगे सैफुद्दीन को सैफुद्दीन है बैट्समैन राइट हैंडेड गुजरात टाइटंस के कांटे का मुकाबला दोनों टीमों के दरमियान कट किया इस मरतबा सीधा फील्डर और मिस अंडरस्टैंडिंग हुई है यहां पर रन आउट की अपील और आउट पहला नुकसान गुजरात टाइटन को पहला विकेट मुंबई के लिए शानदार फील्डिंग बहुत ही उम्दा फील्डिंग अच्छा थ्रो सीधा विकेट कीपर के ग्लव्स में और मोहम्मद बोरी ने कोई गलती नहीं की चाको चौबंद फील्डर मुंबई के मोहम्मद बोरी जिन्होंने पलक झपकते बेल दौड़ा दी एंड द फर्स्ट विकेट फॉर द गुजरात टाइटन्स इज डाउन requesting all the fans not to use the horns it's not allowed the sharja cricket board is not allowing the stadium is not allowing for us the fans to blow the horns so please if you can disregard those and make your voices heard jeetega bhai jeetega jeetega bhai jeetega and after the fall of that first wicket 
the Gujarat fans seem to be a little low, little tense, but the Mumbai fans are being vocal. And it is the captain Messi who comes on strike. Mustafa Messi, the captain of Gujarat Titans, is in the center. The Mumbai Stars will look to get this wicket if they get the captain Mustafa Messi back to the dugout early. They'll fancy their chances in semi-final. On the other hand, it's if Mustafa Messi decides to cut loose, the writing is on the wall for the Mumbai Stars. Not defending a very huge total. And a couple of good overs will take the match away from them. And the first ball Messi plays into the gap. And he's off the mark here. The captain of the Gujarat Titans. In pursuit of happiness. In pursuit of 76. Gujarat Titans are around on 28 for the loss of one wicket so far. And full delivery and well played there. That's gone for a boundary. What a beautiful looking shot there by Mohammed Khum, a.k.a. Rabada. Rabada, champion batsman. That moka is the mal body attacker. Rabada. Rabada, Gujarat, Gujarat team, Gujarat team, please. <laughs> Samna Karenge, Rabada. Ali is full hai baller. Full delivery khel diya on side ki taraf Rabada ne bohat hi unta batting karne. Rabada rubber ki tarah chipak chuke hai Sharja pitch par. Aur ab wo Mumbai stars ko. Har ek shan mein ye dikha rahe hai ki wo kitne achche all rounder hai. Chai wo bowling ho, fielding ho, batting ho. Rabada sab kuch kar sakte hai. Aur Rabada apne captain Messi ka hosta afzai karte hai pitch ke beech. Mustafa Messi kafi relax lag rahe hai. Aman Bhai, who will be able to play the ball, will be able to play the spinner very well. And Rabada's batting is the same thing, that he will be able to play the ball very well. As long as he has hit the ball in front of him, he will be able to play the ball very well. So Mustafa pressed one are being introduced into the attack now, with the Mumbai Stars needing wickets, very desperately and they want to get the main man Mustafa Messi if they have to see any chances of seeing them the, them to the semi-finals <laughs> Messi is already on 26 hitting four boundaries in this inning so far and accompanying him is Sefudin Mandapwala who's playing the waiting game and now it will be the chance of Mustafa Preswala in the attack now, if he can do any wonders. And that's beautifully driven there. Will they come back for two? No, they won't. We saw in the first innings, the Gujarat Titan bowlers applying the brakes, putting the pressure, forcing the Mumbai batsmen to commit the mistakes. And in this innings, we haven't seen that pressure so far. The equation is very simple. 42 runs of 35 balls. This match is in completely in favor of the Gujarat Titans at the moment. And what has Messi done here? It's in the air with the fielder reach there. No, he won't. That was a moment where everyone had their heart in their mouths, especially the Gujarat Titan. 
players and the supporters. Had that been a wicket at that point of time, the pressure would have been right on the Gujarat Titans, but that is not so. I'm telling you, you know, it's written from the gods above. Messi has to play a final. And, uh, no, and is that out? Is that out? It's given. And third umpire is being called there. Third umpire is being called for the first time. Will heart in the mouth kind of moment here for Rabada and the Gujarat Titans. Aman, from the first look, my heart says it was out. What do you think? The replay on the screen there. Looks safe. He's safe. Third Empire looking at that. And I think the foot was on the line. The replay suggests that. The foot on the line. It was not behind the line. Let us see what the third empire decides. Very close call. Seeing a few replays before making up his mind. And he's given him out. And the Mumbai supporters are excited once again. After a lull period, second wicket down for the Gujarat Titans. That's an Lightning speed goal. work there by the wicket keeper. Mustafa Messi is still there out in the middle. And as long as he's there, He's a threat to the Mumbai Stars and their chances of making it to the final today at this Goodwill Cup. Thirty-five for two after four point three overs, just under eight runs per over. The key for the Mumbai Stars will be to keep picking up the wickets as the Gujarat Titans did in the first innings. And as long as Messi is there in the middle, it would be difficult for them to keep this star batsman quiet. Mustafa Preswala, he's done the good work now. The key will be to keep applying that same pressure, keep picking up the wickets, not giving anything away now. The match still in favor of the Gujarat Titans, but a wicket at this stage will make the equation pretty even Steven. Messi on strike now. Sent back. Good call there. Don't need to do any silly mistakes. Just over a runner ball will do for them. They have to keep the wickets intact. In the air, and I think it's sailing over the boundary. The fielder getting underneath that, and he takes it, and he takes it, and that's the end of Messi. What a moment in this match! Will this one delivery decide the fate of this match? 
I think this is one of the most important moments in this match. The star batsman, Mustafa Messi, walking back to the dugout with the team on 36 runs. And Mustafa Press gets the second wicket in this over. He said we are going to win this match by ones and twos, but he tried to go for glory and was caught out in the deep. And what an amazing catch that was. It was sky high going miles up in the air, but the fielder did an amazing job. Hussein Raniwala, the fielder there. Hussein Raniwala, the fielder there. What a perfectly judged catch. And he's got the big man, Mustafa Messi. And the pressure is now on the Guzzat Titans. Five overs, 36 for three, going at 7.2 7 runs per over. The required run rate is eight. Good fight back this by the Mumbai Stars. And what an over by Mustafa Preswala, taking two crucial wickets, giving away just three runs in the previous over, helping his team coming back into this game. Kuresh Rangwala and Wahid Bacha, the two men out there in the middle for the Gujarat Titans now. Good batting there, just releasing the pressure. I think they'll need to do this for the next couple of overs. Ones and twos, preserve the wickets. And then start accelerating again. Hit on the offside, into the gap, chase for the fielder, but the ball wins. And that boundary will just release the pressure after two quick wickets. Hassan Ali Dholkawala, the bowler there. We request the spectators not to use the horns that are given. It's not allowed at the stadium. Please refrain from using them. Straight to short third man for a single. Aman, did you notice things that were happening on the field while you were away? Uh, well, yes, I was interviewing uh, the captain of the play final, Adnan, from Emirati Falcons. And he's also upbeat for the, that match is happening after the semi-final number two. But this semi-final number one is on a knife edge. It's anybody's game here. 42 for three, Gujarat Titans. The game is in the balance. It could be anybody's game. Defending a low total, the Mumbai Stars needed to field well, bowl well, and some amazing display in the field, catching, diving. The Mumbai Stars doing everything possible to restrict the Gujarat Titans here. It's gotta be Kuresh Rangwala on strike here. 34 needed of 25 balls.
And that's well played into the covers for a single. 33 is what they need in four overs if they need to book a place in tonight's grand finale of the Goodwill Cup 2022. So, man, we are six overs down. What are the percentage chances for Mumbai and Gujarat? What do you think? I think both Gujarat and Mumbai are on the same stage at the moment. But Mumbai stars had Murtuza Trunkwala. He took them to 75. Now, can someone put their hands up from the Gujarat Titans? Can they complete the dream of Messi? Well, the Argentinian Messi has so many around him. Will this Mustafa Messi find his Julian Alvarez? Can he find his partner? Can they bring him to the finals? Only time will tell. White delivery. They want to put the pressure. The whites are just helping Gujarat Titans cause. Straight to the fielder at the boundary. Call for second. Uh, sent back. Requesting the audience to throw away the horns that they are blowing. It's been prohibited by the Sharjah Cricket Stadium. Please, requesting all fans. Hello, 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 hello. Thirty-one of twenty-three. Ali Asghar Chitalwala to Wahid Basha. His name suggests there is only one Basha, Wahid. Now, can he live up to his name? And that's cut. Gotta. And that's gone towards the boundary rope. And if we can have the camera panning to the Gujarat bench, Mustafa Messi is dancing here. Seeing this innings from Wahid Bacha. So short and wide deserve the punishment. Ali Asghar, the bowler there. Mumbai stars need to keep things tight. Even a single boundary when defending a low total can be dangerous. And a beautiful looking shot again. And Will it be stopped in the covers? No, it won't. Wahid, Wahid, Wahid. In Arabic, Wahid is one. And he is playing a number one in India. Is Wahid Bacha. Yes, batting like a king. Four consecutive boundaries. And the Gujarat Titans are back on top. This match is seesawing with each and every delivery. He is playing with a strike rate of 325. Four deliveries, 13 runs for Wahid Bacha. Another cut, but this time it will go in the hands of the sweeper fielder. Super batting by Wahid Bacha. He has taken the game here away, I feel. 22 to get of 20 balls. And the Mumbai shoulders are dropping. Well, 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 we only... Flighted delivery and that's well played for a single. Smart batting here by Rangwala. Kuresh Rangwala adding some color to this partnership by rotating the strikes. Yes, I think by just needing over a runner ball, 
They not, don't need to do Twenty one runs needed of nineteen deliveries. Still one ball to go here. Wow, what an upset. What an upset this would be. The unbeaten, the hundred percent maintaining Mumbai stars. They chased every game. They batted the opposition out of the game. They have done so far. And what a shot again. It's going to the boundary. And well fielded there. Wahid Bacha. Take a bow, son. Take a bow, ba Wahid Bacha. Yes, I think Ali has got needed to change his line and length. It's bowling short outside the off. And Wahid Bacha treating it the same way. And the results in his favor. And that's the end of the seventh over. 57 for 3. Looks strong to win this semi final. A Mufad couple of wickets here could change the tide, though, Aman. Mufadal, I feel this match is done and dusted here. The attitude with which Wahid Basha stepped on after an important wicket of Mohammed uh, Mustafa Messi. You know, I thought Mumbai could come back into this game. But Bacha, what, what do I say about him? Those three cut shots for a boundary. He's taken away the game from the Mumbai Stars. And he's made sure that the tournament favorites, Mumbai Stars, are going to be packing their bags early. Aman, we never know till the last ball is bowled. As you know, cricket is a very funny game. I'm sure the Mumbai Stars. And what do we see? Trunkwala has come into bowl now. And well, he would want to repeat the performance of his batting in the bowling as well. Is there anything that this man cannot do? His captain, R.C. Wala, has gone to his main batsman, Murtuza Trankwala. Let's see if he can get the game back in the favor of Mumbai. And he starts off with a wide there. 18 runs needed of 18 deliveries. A runner ball can get them through. Mumbai Stars need a few wickets. Murtaza Trankwala will know that. They want to put the pressure. Create the dot balls. And that's well played there. And well fielded on the boundary. Just a single. And it's got to be Wahid Basha on strike now. Can Trankwala get the Bacha of Gujarat Titans? One wicket at this stage will help Mumbai start sneak into this game. Mufadal, if you were Trankwala, at the moment, you would trade all your 450 runs in this tournament just to get a hat-trick and get Mumbai to qualify for the finals. He would really trade those 400 runs at the moment. Yes, absolutely. It's the result that matters. Head on the offside, call for a double. Sent back and rightly so. They wouldn't mind the singles, Gujarat Titans, even they are sufficient to get them through. 16 to get off 15 deliveries. 16 deliveries. Trankwala. Oh my God, what a tournament he had. And what a sad end it could be if Mumbai don't make it to that final tonight. And it's off the edge, could be taken. And he's picked up a wicked Murtuza Trankwala. Just as I said, the commentators curse to the Gujarat Titans. Yes, and the Mumbai fans wouldn't mind that. They are enjoying this wicket. Trankwala being brought into the attack by Hussein Arsiwala, the captain, and just delivered what he was called for. And that's the end of Wahid Bacha.
Suresh Rangwala. The equation is simple. If you are Gujarat Titans, you would want Wahid Basha to see this off for you. He's seeing the ball like a football. And if you are Gujarat Titans, you would just want him to stay on and finish this game. Will this wicket just give Mumbai Indians a backdoor entry? A chance to get things on track in the last few deliveries. Sixteen runs needed of fifteen deliveries. Three balls to go. The man with the golden arm, Murtaza Trunk. And that's beautifully played here. Will they go for a two? Wahid Basha is running like P.T. Usha in a 100-meter scurry there. And he's completed that run. Wickets falling at the other hand have no effect at all on Wahid Basha. He's doing what he wants to do, hitting boundaries. Taking the tools. And Dave, good shot there by Josef Patel, the new batsman coming in. But the credit here goes to Wahid Basha for running that second there. Short delivery and good ball there by Trunkwala. That's one for the over. I guess from the leg umpire. No, it wasn't. It was a good legit delivery. One ball remaining now. It's been a good over so far. But still, they need 14 runs of 13 balls. It's still very much in the favor of the Gujarat Titans. The pressure when going down the wire can be on both the teams, forcing them to make mistakes. And that's edge and gone! Jose Patel there. Hitting it in the air. Another wicket for Trunkwala. I think someone up there is listening to Trunkwala. He's traded his runs for wickets. And that's what he's got. Two wickets in the over. 14 to win, two overs to go. Yes, what an over by Trunkwala after his fabulous batting performance. Two wickets, five runs, helping Mumbai Stars getting back into the match. I'm sorry for calling this early, but I think these two overs are going to, this match is going to go down to the last ball of the game. It just has a feel. It just has a feel. And suddenly the Mumbai fans are finding their breath. Jitega by Jitega. to get 12 balls to go press wala is the bowler can he press titans into submission or can he be will he be pressed i think press wala would love to repeat the performance of his last over giving away just three runs picking up two wickets how he would wish he does the same picking up two wickets in this over as well What a beautiful looking shot. Wahid Basha's square cuts are something to die for. 
he is really playing that shot really, really well. He sees anything short and wide outside off stumps, and he is punishing them. And Hopefully needed of 11 deliveries now. New batsman, Hussein Piplode. Now, can he explode here? The Gujarat Titans would want him to explode over on the bowler. And the Stars would want him to get out early. And here he goes. It's a chance. And it's a six. And that is a drop. Guys, guys. No, no blowing horns, guys. Please, please, no blowing horns. It's not allowed. It's not allowed. No blowing horns. That is a costly, costly miss. He misjudged that. And I think that is curtains on a tournament that had Mumbai Star's name almost written on it. But Gujarat Titans have spoiled another party. Just when it looked that the Mumbai Stars have put pressure and are looking favorites, this one six, this one shot has changed the equation once again. What confidence from Hussein Piplod. First ball of the match. What do you do? You hit a six. Just under pressure. Got a just shot there. That's a wicket down. After hitting a six, stumped by the wicket keeper. A much needed wicket, but is it too late? Mufadal, I feel this is this is poor cricket here by Hussein Piplod. You just hit a six. You need seven of 11. You just rotate strike, finish this game off. Wahid Basha is on the other end. You have so much confidence from him. He's played so well. And uh, I'm, if, if you are Gujarat right now and Messi, you will not be happy with that shot by Hussein Piplod. Yes, he was just wandering down on the pitch without any reason. And the wicket keeper just fumbled once, but was still quick enough to uproot the stumps and stumping him out. This is the second stumping in this match he's done. And six wickets down now for the Gujarat Titans. And the match going down the wire, tilting with each delivery. And the new batsman is going to be Hatim Kisak, number 57. It's not easy for a new batsman to come in, especially when you're lower down the order. Now, if I was Mumbai Stars, you would bring the field in. You want to put this new batsman under pressure. And I can't see that happening here from the Mumbai Stars. They aren't attacking much. They should be attacking this new batsman. Now he's putting the fielders in here. Maybe the commentators are being heard loud and clear there. Seven needed of nine deliveries. And that's where into the hands. Chance, Wahid Basha, direct hit. Not out, says the umpire. Yeah. It was direct hit was needed there. For a moment, everyone's heart was in their mouth. A wicket at this stage would have got the Mumbai stars as favorites. Still, the Scale is in favor of the Gujarat Titans. Mumbai stars need to find some inspiration or that sta those stars are not going to shine tonight. When this stadium is under lights, it will be the Titans. They need to find some inspiration or else it will be a sad end to a wonderful tournament for the Mumbai stars. The Gujarat Titans they won it. win their semi-final in style. And what's more? Wahid Basha, what have you done? You have just created history. The Mumbai Stars have been knocked out of this year's SBT 10 Season 5 Goodwill Cup 2022. 
they were touted to be the favorites the champion team but gujarat titans have done it they have created an upset their target was to qualify for super 6 and they have booked a date and are the first finalist of this year's sbt 10 Season five, Goodwill Cup 2022. Yes, Wahid Bacha, the man of the moment right now, the star who did the damage when the tables were down, and what an inning by Wahid Bacha! 24 runs of nine deliveries, three boundaries, one six, took the attack to the opposition, and just floored the Mumbai Stars, and they had no answer to his batting. Mufaddal, as they say. Commit the ah, commit the man, and two men came from Gujarat Titans. One with the ball, who took three wickets for nine runs, and Wahid Basha with the bat. They had two men tonight. It will be a tough de decision for the umpires to give the man of the match tonight in this game. Yes, but let us a thought for the Mumbai Stars, unbeaten throughout the tournament, some fine performances. by Hussain Chuankwala the batsman and Hasan Ali Dholkawala one of the leading wicket takers in this tournament and just one match where things didn't go right for them and unfortunately that was a knockout match the semi finals well played messi well played team gujarat titans Well played, Mumbai Stars. Hussain Arsiwala, Hussain Trankwala. They played so well in this whole tournament. Just one match, one bad match, and they are knocked out. Just before we go for the huddle. I've got the captain of the Gujarat Titans with his daughter here Mustafa Messi Mustafa what's the feeling in the camp It's a really feeling amazing With the 25 year legacy based on unwavering reliability and unflinching values Goodwill developers have successfully created a community of 2200 plus happy customers in Navi Mumbai who are cherishing the joy of abundance every day Since 1997 we have expanded our footprint in residential and commercial spaces to over 2.5 million square feet. It has been a journey filled with many achievements but our core value through those milestones has remained the same that of living up to our name. We have always placed supreme emphasis on seamless process and align all our team members to execute every effort with efficiency. Over the years, we have also established a reputation for completing all projects on time for possessions as it is the most crucial ingredient required to retain trust in customers. Our business model also follows transparency in our dealings so as to ensure no roadblocks on our passage to success. Our grand vision is to create new age landmarks that exemplify excellent expertise in both the science and the art of construction. Our mission is to become a name synonymous with honesty and earn recognition across the length and breadth of the country. At Goodwill Developers, we believe that true business is more than just mere numbers. It's also about lives enriched and stories created. Our diverse portfolio of completed projects, our recently completed project Goodwill Unity, a thriving landmark in Sanpada, serves as a symbol of quality delivery. Goodwill Abroad Dungarli Lonavla Located amidst hilly Lonavla Goodwill Abroad is an address where tranquility attains a presence that is as eternal as time These are recently completed lavish 3 4 and 5 BHK villas with a private plunge pool in each villa You can luxuriate in the lavish environs of an one-acre recreational space with amenities like clubhouse, modern gymnasium, cafe, swimming pool, and astroturf. 
living at any of the luxurious villas isn't just a privilege, it's a mark of having it all. In the past, we have also executed several other dresses with similar panache and perfection. Our broad presence has expanded with four landmark and priceless projects added in our crown. Our current ongoing projects stand as testaments of our expertise in building eminent structures. Goodwill Biz Hub Strategically situated next to IKEA in Navi Mumbai's commercial epicenter, Goodwill Biz Hub offers commercial spaces for MSMEs to access the apex of a thriving market. Furthermore, Goodwill Biz Hub also provides commercial spaces on the ground floor and boutique offer spaces on the 8th and 9th floor. Spread across an enormous 4 acres, the landmark is a G plus 9 storey edifice with 16 feet floor to floor height. The shining highlight of this project is that the first to the seventh floor will be dedicated to industrial MSME units. To ease the experience of business processes, there is an exclusive ramp provided for tempo with five to seven tons capacity on each floor. In total, the project will have 18 elevators to support various functions and a 12 meter internal driveway to smoothen the processes. This is a realm where ambition doesn't have to stay limited to touching the sky. The work is going on in full swing so as to ensure possession in just a year's time. We have now launched our commercial project, codename W High Street. Located off Palm Beach Road, this prestigious landmark will offer 32 dual level retail showrooms on G plus one level. These spaces will have 14 feet height on each floor. Curtsy, its prime location, which enjoys superb market loyalty, investing here is sure to yield high rental income. These outlets have maximum visibility thanks to 42 meter and 11 meter wide roads adjoining the project. It's time for you to book it, own it, and flaunt it. Codename West View. Find a new canvas for redefining your imagination in three and four premium bed residences. Three BHK starting from 1,130 square feet. Four BHK starting from 1,940 square feet with sprawling decks overlooking the hills, the city and the sea. Situated in an upper crust corner of Palm Beach Road in Sector 19, Farshi. These are homes that brew a serene blend between the best of lifestyle amenities, courtesy a clubhouse on the podium level. Unveiling soon. With a vision to continue in the same vein as the last 25 years, Goodwill developers are looking ahead towards a future filled with many more milestones, many more happy families and many more incredible addresses.